So, Tanya, are you ready to reveal this issue, this question, right? Yeah. Well, we haven't said it yet, so nothing's set in stone. Um, we are... The reason why it's been taking so long for us to figure out a date and a venue is because we do want to do destination, but there are a lot of kids involved, and so we have to do it around kids' school schedules. And summer was too soon, like, t- to give people notice. And so we started thinking about the months after summer, and we kind of landed on Thanksgiving because kids have that full week off of school and there's something very kind of peaceful and calm about that week in I do agree with that. There's a there's a calm in the country about that. Yeah. Week. And so I we th- we're tossing around that idea and I was like, you know, I don't know, it just seems kind of off to invite people Thanksgiving weekend. So I started talking to my bridesmaids to see kind of their temperature on it and all of them were like, "Yes." Yes, yes, yes. Let's go. But are um, there families invited? Yeah, Your bridesmaids they, families invited? Do they have kids and families? Uh, none of my bridesmaids have kids. They have families, and some like one, like two of my bridesmaids. Wait, they don't what? have kids. They have families. They, well, like they well, have, everyone has everyone a family. Has a family. <laughs> okay. But do they have kids? No, they don't have kids. Um, well, that makes it much easier yeah. for them to say yes. <laughs> uh, but some of them, like two of my bridesmaids, are sisters, so we're gonna invite you know like their mom to come, and so there will be some of their family members that would come. Um, But they were all like, this is such a great time. Like, I get work off. I get, you know, they were all like, we have work off. Or my sister was like, the kids don't have school. So everything kind of started falling into people were like, yeah, let's do it. So your question is, how would you feel about a Thanksgiving weekend wedding? So when would be arrivals? Friday? Yeah. I mean, people can kind of arrive whenever, but we would do, yeah, like a Friday, Saturday, Saturday, Sunday Sunday. situation. Yeah. Right. Uh, Well, she asked me this I don't know if it was a text or a phone call. I can't remember. Right. Uh, Sisney, what did you say about it? I think it's different when it's a trip because you make a, you make a whole week out of it, right? So it's like an adventure, yeah. so to speak. I did go to a wedding once about 10 years ago that was on Thanksgiving weekend, but it was local. And it was a little bit of a damper just because mm. you're kind of in family mode already kind yeah. of. And then to like break it up and then go to like a wedding that Friday or Saturday, I forget when it was. But if you're making a whole trip out of it, then then that's that's the Thanksgiving vacation. That's like what you're doing, and then you're also having your wedding. I, this is a this is a can't win situation, by the way. Right? You know? You're this never like, going to make gotta, everyone happy. No, you just got to decide what's best for you. you and Robbie, and what you'll remember most, and what's most meaningful to you, because you will not please everyone with this. This somebody's going to go. How dare they? But then also they think about your Thanksgiving anniversary time. Yeah. Well, that's what we were thinking about. We were like, how special Thanksgiving has kind of always been meaningful to Robbie and I. Like we we hosted Thanksgiving, like one of our first years of dating, and so we were kind of like, maybe Thanksgiving will become what Mark's face. What do you, Mark's you hate face. it? What did you do, Mark? What? Would you no, like to give your opinion? It was. No. I get, keep going. What was his face? No, it was just like. That doesn't sound like, terribly special, but okay. <laughs> Lots of couples so host, lots of couples host Thanksgiving, but Every yours year. was no, extra but we were special. thinking no, but we were thinking like maybe Thanksgiving <laughs> becomes like our thing. Forget about Thanksgiving and forget about it being special to you. Just know that when you get married, where and whatever date you choose, that your anniversary is going to fall on that every year. So you're always like, if you ever want to take a trip for your anniversary, you're always going to have to like ditch family on Thanksgiving, or they come with you on your anniversary well, trip. That's what we would think. We would host well, Thanksgiving like Thanksgiving would become our thing, and we would just host it every single year, and it would kind of be like. But you would so never go the away. Would be the family. Yeah, yeah. Like the, you would never go saying, away for your anniversary. I think what she's trying to say is like, once y'all are in this for ten, you're going to want some lonely timing. <laughs> And so lonely time on Thanksgiving is going to be a conflict. Is I, what she's. This is a picture she's trying to paint. It's just you're not making your anniversary like special, like the the date of it. Does that make sense? So there's the thing. If we don't do it in Thanksgiving, then we have to wait till 2025. Why? Because of the, again school school they go back in for. Or, or I guess we could do December. Guys, but. Again, I don't want to harp on it, but it is complicated to plan a big wedding. It totally is. <laughs> You're losing the spirit of you. Always, I always say this. Focus on what makes you guys you. happy. And by the way, she asked me, "How is it good for me?" I'm like, "Fine for me. I'm yeah. good." <laughs> exactly. She's like, "Can you perform on Thanksgiving?" Like Someone, the day after, I'm good. Not yeah. perform. You're not performing. You're what not singing. I, I picture Ryan coming in with like a Harry Styles. I have a band. Like a I have a marching like, band. I have arrived. Yes, I have a cape and a marching band. Upon a arrival. Cape. Yes. A cape. Don't ordain. Like, don't the ordainments have capes? Out of the aisle. <laughs> <laughs> Shimmy's down. I'm uh, here, guys. 
and your anniversary <laughs> dinner can be cold turkey sandwiches. It's all fun. <laughs> <laughs> Kickball change, dim so the light. Do you have budget for an elevator? Because I'd like to come out from under the ground. Uh, <laughs> I'm picturing like a fog machine. Fog and I need, and a, wind. I need wind. wind. I yeah. need wind. Need features. You need yeah. that Beyonce wind. Yeah. yeah, I need features. Well, could you lock the date down if it's going to be this Thanksgiving? Because, oh, that's a while away. Yeah, it's like nine months. Right. A little over nine months.